I, in preparation for this interview, reached out to a couple other leaders in AI and technology and gathered a couple questions for you. Okay. So this next question is from Stripe CEO Patrick Collison. This will be a good one, I'm sure. Read this verbatim. It's about the next stage. What what comes after GPT five? In which year do you think a large language model will make a significant scientific discovery? And what's missing such that it hasn't happened yet? He caveated here that we should leave math and special case models like AlphaFold aside. He's specifically asking about fully general purpose models like the GPT series. I would say most people will agree that that happens at some point over the next two years, but the definition of significant matters a lot. And so some people's significant might happen, you know, in early 25, some people might maybe not until late 2026, sorry, early 2026, maybe some people not until late 2027. But I would I would bet that by late 27, most people agree that there has been an AI driven significant new discovery. And the thing that I think is missing is just the kind of cognitive power of these models A framework that one of the researchers said to me that I really liked is, you know, a year ago, we could do well on like a high school like a basic high school math competition, problems that might take a professional mathematician seconds to a few minutes. We very recently got an IMO gold medal. That is a crazy difficult, like... Could you explain what that means That's kind of like the hardest competition math test. This is something that like the very, very top slice of the world, many, many professional mathematicians wouldn't solve a single problem. And we scored at the top level. Now there are some humans that got an even higher score in the gold medal range, 